Hey guys, I'm Amarat and in this video I will show you how to set up and install WMO plugin for Blender. So you will need the Blender and I would advise you to get as new version as possible. So in my case, I've got 278 version, uh, or get as new version as possible. And uh, now we will need a plugin. Well, you can find it on MCNet, I will link it in the description. And there is the last release version, which is currently 1.0.4, uh, which is getting a little bit old and is lacking a lot of features which are currently in the development. So you can use this one, and uh, this one will work just fine for you. Or you can go to GitHub, and uh, here you can download the newest version of plugin, which uh, is still under development now. You can also contact SCARN uh, if you want to help uh, with, uh, with development of uh, WMO plugin uh, or you can contact him if you find any sort of issues. So here's issues part and uh, you can prop, uh, you know, request any feature or you can report any bug you find and so on. If you want to download it from GitHub, you will just click here clone or download and download zip. And you will download it. Uh, if you want to use this uh, plugin, at the moment it requires two another plugins which aren't part of this plugin, and these are Blender Mesh, uh, Mask Smooth Normals, and uh, this one, Material Util. So these two plugins are needed in order to make WMO plugin work if you want to use the newest version from uh, GitHub at the moment. So uh, you might want to download them or you will need to download them uh, as well if you want to use this version. If you want to use this version from MCNet, you will be fine just with it. Uh, but uh, for this version, you will need those two as well. So how to install it? Well, you will need this folder. Again, just download zip or you would download this whole folder here. Download this file. And uh, you need this IOC in WMO folder. And in case of those two, you need this uh, PI file. And in this case, you will need this download link. And in, it will open probably like this. So we want to just save it. We will want to download this as well. And we will want to download this as well. And we got our files downloaded here. So I will just extract them. And what you will need is this Python file. If you want to use the newest version, you will need those two Python files. And definitely you will need this IOC WMO folder. So either this one thing if you are downloading from MCNet or these two things as well if you are getting the newest version from repository. Now you will want to go to uh, your Blender installation path. In my case it's C, Program Files, a Blender Foundation, Blender, and 278 and scripts and add-ons. So here's the full path you need to follow if you have uh, installed your Blender into default folder. And we need to get into this add-ons folder here. And here we will just copy either this folder or these three things if you are using the newest version. And you will just copy it and place it here. When you have got this done, you need to get into Blender. You will want to open File and go to User Preferences. And now you can just search for you need to get to add-ons from, you will probably get to interface, so let's go to add-ons. You need to search for WMO and check this. If you are using the newest version, you want to search for MESC as well. So MESC, soft and hard and normals, you want to check this as well. And the last one, let's take a look what was its name. It was, I think, yeah, material details. So, Material, ah, here it is. Material utils, so check these as well, or at least this one. Uh, so make sure that these are checked if you are using the newest version as well. And we've got this checked, 
your uh, UWO plugin should be installed and it should work. If you are using the newest version, this, the, this wall uh, should appear here and uh, there are some extra options as well. We got this root here and so on. So this is a way of installing WMO plugin into Blender and making it work. And we will, or I will show you how to use it in another video. So that's for now everything I wanted to speak about. Thanks for watching, guys, and happy morning.